Hey, what is up guys? I'm Rahul and today for you I'm going to be giving a tutorial on how to create the China Rising text effect that is in Battlefield 4. Now like before, the um, actual download will be in the description so you will get this file then you can manipulate it for however you want. So um, for instance, you could just duplicate this layer and put it on like here. This is my um, one channel background, I just copied this and put it here. So um, uh, yeah, I'll just show you how I did it now. So anyway, to start off, um, let's just go on right click blending options. Oh, in fact, actually, just um, for all you Photoshop people that don't really have a clue about Photoshop, just um, how you do it is click this little T button and then you can drag a box and then this is how you create text. But I'm sure you all know how to do that. So actually on your text, um, the font I'm using is the Perista, I think it's called. I might have said that wrong. Um, I'll try and get a download link for you guys in the description if you want. But um, I guess you could use this for any font that you think is fitting. But for me, the Perista font looks the best. So what you want to do for the um, actual effects, I'll just right click and go into blending options. Um, first one was the inner glow. The inner glow, um, you don't really have to have, as you can see, without it, it kind of um, looks a bit grayish and dullish, but with it, it gives that little bit of an oomph. You don't really need it, and um, I don't know, you can change the other settings to make it work without it, but I don't know, I just chose the inner glow. For the colour you want it going out to transparent but for this one I think this was the default colour I'm not too sure but um yeah this is the little um code in case you guys want it but um yeah you guys can just pick it so it's kind of like a middle in the yellowish section but um just pick what you guys think is right. Next up we've got the actual colour overlay now this one you don't actually need to do I just um don't actually know why I did it either but um I think it's because before my text was red and I didn't realise that I had to change um this colour but um you guys don't really have to have this one but if your text is a different colour then just put a colour overlay but to be honest you're probably going to have a normal coloured text anyway and you if you don't really have a clue about photoshop you probably won't have any idea what I'm talking about now so I'll go on to the next one and this gradient one you do kind of want um and the actual one I chose was this kind of um palish um beachy colour I think uh here's the code again so it's on the yellowish section again in fact, I could even make it more orangey. So, um, just again, pick what's right for you. What I was doing was I just had that China Rising um, picture up near me. So then I could just go and have a look at it, see if it looks all good. And um, then I kind of got it best for looking how I want it to look. And um, yes, that's all good. Make sure your opacity is actually down a little bit on this one because you do want to see your pattern. Now, this is an optional thing. It just gives it a little kind of... Um, I, I don't know how to explain it, but it gives it a kind of oomph on the text and um, the pattern itself is just three pixels down, one pixel across, and it's um, a blank and then a black dot, then blank, so on, um, or transparent, whatever you want to say, and um, then I just put it on and it kind of gives a nice um, feel to the text. Also, these um, this is actually called scan lines. I think I did a tutorial about this ages ago, but um, you can use this in all kind of pictures or anything. So, and it makes your picture just have a little bit of a kind of feel towards it. And I don't really know how to explain it, but it just looks a little bit cool. And finally, the um, part which gives it its um, whole kind of China rising effect is the outer glow. So, as you can see there, the um, color is in fact quite important. So, I'm here as again, um, as always, transparent. And then on this side, uh, this is the code. Um, yeah, it's just this one. I guess you could change it a little bit if you want, but um, it's right there near the end, near the bottom, and then in the middle. What I did to actually get this color was on the China Rising, then use this little um, color picker, and I just picked it like that. So, um, yeah, that's that. And um, as always, if you are changing the text size, just change the size of your um, what's it called of this thingy outer glow. Change the size of your outer glow so um, you can make it the right size. Uh, don't make it too big like that. Um, this just like yeah, just do what it feels right for you so yeah that's about it on this kind of size I don't know it doesn't look too great but um as you can see on this um, size here it does look pretty cool so I've got my number one so for Battlefield 4 probably not but um I think I'm a pretty good um, pretty good Battlefield 4 commentator and then also I've got it here so overall it does look quite quite cool and um, yeah, if you guys do want any other kind of Photoshop tutorials, please tell me in the comment section below because I can do them. I'm decent at Photoshop. I know um, my way around. I've been using it for a couple years now, so um, I've got kind of an idea of what to do. So if you guys want anything done, I can do that for you. And yeah, like I said, um, 
if you actually do want anything done just leave in the comments i can definitely do that for you guys say if you want um some kind of text or the battlefield text you want that done for you guys if you don't have photoshop or if you don't know how to use it just message me on youtube or leave it in the comment section below i'll happily do it for you guys because um got nothing else really to do so i'll do that for you guys and yeah i've been rahul this video has gone on for too long um download the link in the description and um yeah i've been rahul hopefully you guys have enjoyed the video